May I present Archibald Cunningham? His Grace the Duke of Argyll. Archibald Archie Cunningham is the main antagonist of the 1995 historical action drama film Rob Roy. I am your Grace's humble servant. He is the Marquis of Montrose, sadistic chief henchman. Cunningham, who comes from an aristocratic family, is sent to work for the Marquis of Montrose in the hopes that the Scottish climate will cool the fever in his blood. So, Mr. Cunningham, what are these principal sins that distress your mother? Or are you a bugger of boys? However, Cunningham is trouble from the start seducing Betty, the young housemaid, while working in the Marquis residence and recklessly spending the Marquis money. To whom you owe 87 pounds, extended this credit because you were my guest. Robert Roy McGregor, better known as Rob Roy, a native Scot, is attempting to build up his holdings and provide a home for his people, is one guy who intends to stretch every last penny. He makes a loan agreement with James Graham, Marquis of Montrose, for 1,000 guineas. A man of property intent on growing richer. A guinea was a term for one pound one shilling in the old British currency and a thousand guineas would be ten fifty pounds. Am I not accustomed to a quarter on unsecured loans? McGregor has three hundred acres at Craig Roston, my lord. Cunningham hears of McGregor's money arrangement through Montrose Factor Killer. Money, Archie. Money. What else? And murders McGregor's buddy, Alan MacDonald, which whom McGregor trusted to get the money from Killer. He killed Alan McDonald on the way home, <laughs> took the money and dumped the body in the nearby lake. With no knowledge of his friend's whereabouts, Rob attempts to make a new contract for more money. I have but lost a thousand pounds. You ask me to risk another. Montrose will agree if Rob falsely testifies that his opponent, John Campbell, second Duke of Argyle, is a Jacobite. I want your word against. Rob declines, knowing Campbell only by reputation. You owe me. I owe you money. Nothing more. When Rob implies that Montrose is dishonest, Montrose orders Archie to arrest him. Take him into custody, Archibald. You have my commission on it! Rob pulls out a concealed knife and keeps Archie at bay before pushing him to the ground and running away. Montrose orders Archie to find Rob and bring him to justice. Cunningham greedily accepts the task of bringing him in. Broken but not dead. It has a ring to it. He runs towards McGregor's house with a small unit of soldiers where his wife Mary remains behind. Cunningham gives the order to burn down the family's home, ruin their crops, and kill their livestock. <laughs> He then rapes Mary in order for Rob Roy to seek vengeance for her, and smiles as he leaves, making sure Mary knows his identity. Tell him Archibald Cunningham is at his service. Cunningham finally captures McGregor, tying him up and brutally beating him before dragging him behind a racing horse for Cunningham's pleasure. The next morning, Montrose gives the order to hang McGregor from a near bridge. Hang him from the bridge. However, Rob quickly grabs the rope that is binding his hands, loops it around Cunningham's neck, and leaps from the bridge. <laughs> Rob then uses the dead animal to hide from the search group, which will not approach due to the stench. Oh. <laughs> Rob Roy escapes only to discover the horrific truth about what Cunningham did to his wife, and he arranges a duel with the scoundrel Cunningham. Bring him on. You speak, Archibald. The rules are simple. There will be no backstabbing. You will not throw your blades, nor will you use weapons other than agreed. Cunningham and McGregor swear that they will not yield or take any concessions. No quarter will be asked. Given. Armed with a rapier, Cunningham frequently wounds McGregor, who looks to exhaust himself quickly wielding a heavy broadsword. <laughs> Cunningham clearly outperforms McGregor. He plays with McGregor, slicing him numerous times on his body and finally on his dueling arm, disarming him. <laughs> He 
taught that victory was certain, he lifted McGregor's chin with his sword to end the fight and McGregor's life. However, McGregor grabs the blade of Cunningham's sword with his bare hand. He then takes his own sword and strikes Cunningham hard across the torso, nearly chopping him in half, killing him. Archibald Cunningham Archibald Cunningham is also called Archie. His crimes include murder, thief, torture, pillaging, and rape. He is a psychopathic rapist. Archibald Cunningham is portrayed by Tim Roth. Love is a dunghill, Betty, and I am but a cock that climbs upon it to crow. <laughs>